substance that the body don't need more. The kidney are used a lot of things in the body, the quantity of water, the pH of the body, and the equilibrium of calcium, sodium, potassium, the arterial pressure also is controlled by the kidneys. principal metabolic waste product water carbon dioxide or CO2 and the product of the nitrogenose this is called urea uric acid and creatinine these three metabolic products are laboratory tests to diagnosis disease of the kidney. Urea. Urea is very important because urea is the substance that gives the characteristic yellow color of the urine. It's an organic chemical compound that is essential one carbon with two nitrogen and hydrogen molecules. Uric acid is produced for the natural breakdown of your body cells and from the food that you eat. It's a more complex molecule. Creatinine is a product of the muscle and is very important laboratory examination to know how are working the kidneys. Urea analysis. Urea analysis is essential to detect urinary tract disorders because there are a lot of diseases that you cannot diagnose with ultrasound because are microscopic and there are diseases of the glomerulus or other diseases that the ultrasound cannot diagnose but the urea analysis can make the diagnosis. The presence of an acute infection causes hematuria. Hematuria is one of the most important things that can happen in urine and there are a lot of diseases of the kidney that produce hematuria. Puria is the presence of pus in the urine and is in general with infection of the kidneys, in other words, pielonephritis. The control of the acidic or alkaline urine is other of the function of the kidney and very important function for the body. When the pH is not normal, the body is not good. This is one of the most important controls of the kidneys. The abundance of hydrogen ions in the solution is called pH concentration of hydrogenions the formation of renal calculi or renal stone depend in part of the acidity of the urine A specific gravity or also density that measure the capacity of the kidney to concentrate the urine when the kidney are not working, the density of the urine is exactly the density of the water. In other words, number one. You can see here in this very interesting feature the quantity of different elements in the urine. Urea, the substance that gives the yellow color to the urine, is 25.5 grams and uric acid is very little bicarbonate creatinine potassium sodium and chlorum and chloride are other part of the urine the specific gravity or density is very low when there are renal failure 
when there are renal failure in general you can see a echogenic little kidney because the cortex that is the part that produces the urine is not more present. This disease causes renal tubular damage which affects the ability of the kidney to concentrate the urine. Hematocrit is the proportion of blood volume that is occupied by red blood cells. It is normally about 46% for men and 38% for women. The kidney also produces a hormone that is called erythropoietin. This is not about the function of to produce urine. It's a other function that has the kidney to produce the substance that is essential in the production of the red cells. Hemoglobin, the presence of hemoglobin during occur when there are hematuria with damage of destruction of the functioning red blood cells. Protein urine normally is not protein in the urine. When there are glomerular problems, there are albumin and other plant protein can be filtered in the urine. Creatinine clearance. Creatinine clearance is a very important measure because determine the quantity of blood that is effectively filtered in the glomerulus. This is other important laboratory. When the creatinine is elevated in blood, the filtration in the glomerulus is low. Blood urea nitrogen, this is called boom, is the concentration of urea. It's similar to creatinine and it's other important laboratory to know how the kidney are cleaning the blood. When the urea is elevated, the kidney are not working good. Serum creatinine, this is the concentration of creatinine in blood. It's similar to urea, but it's also good to calculate the clearance of creatinine. 